<laughs> they would gladly have given us two coaches, but then we had to have the diesel, so no. I, I didn't think about it. It's very cosy. Yeah. 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 Go by Stadler. Are you surprised they haven't gone down the route of places like the Rockwell Park? Commissioned oil fired locations. They have. Most of them are new. Have they, have they got quite a few? Yes. Ah, yes. oh, right. Yeah. I have a yard to put on this one. I'd like to have a look. Yes, I, I don't really know the story at all. But you go in Switzerland, you go to the end of the Well, look at how oh, steep the railway really? suddenly gets. Yeah. Look ahead, chaps. <laughs> look ahead. Look at, look at the steepness of the line ahead now. <laughs> God. Well, you don't have a system of roads, do you? And work for the middle out. Two seats. The people, the people you who know, we work for the middle out, the people on the edge of the go off the road. So, uh -huh. yeah. <laughs> I see where you're sitting, where you're sitting. It's one. Yeah. 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 You can. Yeah, she's working hard now. If you want to do it, do you want to sit here? I'm quite happy to move. Is that okay? I'm not going to I don't mind having a few laps. Okay? You like getting on your lap when the train goes past. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I think I'm breathing. <laughs> It'd be nice to see it from the side watch you go past. Because it sounds like an express local at speed, but it's the rat. Do you mind shutting the door into first class? That makes me terrible. But it's like a. <laughs>
There's another train coming down. Diesel coming down. It's really nice to stand in the field and watch these go past. Oh look, there's the passing loop. And this is the first kilometre. So you can see the post, that's the kilometre post. Points the whole rail was to swivel. I think it'd be safe to leave the See how complex the point is. Is this the point? Yeah. yeah. They're just overly complex to what we need. Oh, good lord, yes. Yeah, so there's like a conventional point and then the track and the rack. I'll get the hang of this now. I'll get the train. I have no idea what's going on. See that swivels to change the racket to change. Oh, 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 oh,
That's really Do that in the head. Right. It's all right, I can put it all together, but it's just inconvenient. I bought, I looked and I'm not filming, so. Oh, yes. 
I remember last time we were talking about you know, Tim and his video channel. Oh, Tim, yeah. Tim Hitchcock. Yeah. Tim was with me. Uh, he said he met in the boot. Yeah. Uh, what has he been up to? Well, I'm not saying I'm copying him. I'm just thinking along his. It, he, he's just a lot more professional than I am. So, yeah. It's Dresden. Dresden. Were yeah. you on that one? Well, recently. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. He's. Um, Sometimes when I see his videos, I can hear my voice in the background going, if you just like... Well, put it this way, you're probably going to say it's going to happen now, so... Yeah. Don't say anything you don't want on YouTube. Is there... um... I've not actually met him yet, he and I keep talking about meeting up. So, um, at some point we will. He's a terrifically nice guy. I'm sure, yeah, you see... You can sort of get a vibe off people, even if it's just online. I, I get that vibe from him that he seems like. He is, he is one of life's gentlemen. Yeah. And uh, his fascination with the camera is truly yeah. awe-inspiring. Okay. We were minus 16 or something at one point in one of our recent, and he's still there resolutely trying to get his camera on the front of the road. <laughs> Barely move his fingers to see yeah. I'm gonna have to get a GoPro like him eventually, but yeah, they're very good. Yeah, I mean, I'm just using my phone. On the whole, I can get to get quite good videos. Yeah. Yeah. I made quite a nice one of flying Scotland the other day. The one to you Yeah. Like my um, film, I mean, I'm on the train. It's not quite the same. My film, a couple of the rare bits of track and. About one and a half thousand people watch it, so I was quite happy. Well, when Scotsman was first repainted, yeah. uh, it was included at the start of one of the Great Britain series. Yeah. And uh, I, I, I got a call to say, would I like to go up to Edinburgh? Oh, okay. So I remember. Yeah, I went on the last leg of the Great Britain this year. Oh, did you? I asked nicely, asked Les nicely, could I... Could it, they did things to Felix, though, which is incredibly rare. Yeah. And into Liverpool Street, so I just said, you know, can I come for a ride? And he said, yeah, OK. He said, sort of sit down in the break, be quiet, and... Go, the don't. nice thing about ITC is they will... We have a number of people. Uh, do you know Vaughan? Who? Vaughan. 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 No, I don't... Four drops in and out of doors all the time for me. And I still turn up in the oldest place just for a few days and he's always all paid up and everything, but he just he can't get the time to cover all of them all together. I see, yeah. I think that's a deer proof fence if I'm not much to see. I used to work in the deer park. Yeah, that is. Yeah, I worked for the National Trust at one point. So, did you? Yeah. Where are Attingham Park in Shropshire. Oh, right. And one of my favourite jobs was we'd have bad weather. Yeah. I used to have to walk the deer park fence perimeter, looking for any breakage. And it was like all morning. It'd take you all morning a five-mile walk. It was a perfect. Yeah, it was a perfect start. Well, we have a small deer park in Greenwich, of course. Yes, I know it, yeah. The top of the, uh, the, top of the pub there, so I, I often go up there. Yeah, my girlfriend likes going there. I've taken her there a few times. Do you, do you live in London? Or? I live in Buckinghamshire, so... Oh, you're not Yeah, near Jarrah Cross, south of Buckinghamshire. So it's quite a handy spot, then, for their day trips. I can get up to London. Yeah, oh, gosh, yeah. Sometimes I get sent to Didcot, or for that Cardiff one with Scotland, I had to get to Didcot, that was quite easy. Yeah. Well, that's what I like about the Scottish Cup, because it's always nice to have a bit of a change.
Yes, you can. Yes, you can. Don't be silly. Yes, you can. Gordon was always like Yeah. So was Henry, unfortunately. <laughs> I remember my mum, when I was little, I was sort of complaining, oh, I've got a headache, I don't feel great. She was like, God, why did I call you Henry, the one who's always got something wrong with him? I should have called you Thomas, James or Edward. Maybe not Gordon. Exactly. Exactly. I, always, I always like Toby. Yeah, he's a nice little... Um, yeah. I'm, I'm, There's another local. I'm, I'm doing the Norfolk tour this year. How are you? We're going to the North Norfolk World well, yeah. which has Toby. There's a, a tram there, isn't it? Yeah. I think so. And whoever the, the director of that is was a passenger of mine a while ago. Alright. Let me see him again. Yeah, because you get that day trip where you go on the charter train. Is it to Windsor this year, isn't it? I think. Oh, is that? I, well, because you know, my mother and I. Stewart, um, but we're not. Um, I'm not. I'm on not the, available on, on for that. The RTC the yeah, we. Yeah. Because I don't really get to know anything about the day trips. You know, they never tell me anything about those. And normally, I'm so busy with everything else. Yeah. I've got time for watching things. I don't even do that often. I do not do a lot. Well, I. Yeah. I know, I know a few of the crew. I had a few of them on my last tour, didn't I? The, uh, I had the. What's his name? The senior steward. Les. Yeah. Which tour was that? Uh, where was it? Andrew will tell you. Oh, yeah. Happy Christmas, everybody, from the train. I think we've come forward six months. Excuse me, throw a vine up in these easier parts. Oh, stop. Oh, stop. Like having a table. Yeah. Yes, if they it helps put me in a, a room that doesn't have a table, I will go and say, I don't care what room you find, but find me somewhere with a desk. Well, I don't know what your room is, but I've got a, a little table, but I've got a shelf behind you. So shelf unit? Well, we could be putting quarantine as we were at the Palace Hotel. So was that on the tour then? We were out in, up in Orkney. Oh, okay. And um, they quarantined 12 of them on Orkney. And they, the Orkney people wanted to get rid of the rest of us who tested negative. So we went on at that point. People in Orkney went bananas and said we had to go into quarantine as well. Oh, it's a long story. 
that was when Scotland had different regulations. Yeah. I remember taking a group in early 2022 when you started to wear a mask and I just kept getting asked where can we get a copy, where can we get it? Then I took one a few weeks later and the mask relays were gone. No one asked at all about getting a copy because you know they weren't they wanted it just to say I always thought that was silly, the moment you got a copy in your hand you didn't have to wear a mask. Well, in, we were wearing masks in Germany. So well November last year we were. Um, this yeah, I knew where yeah. Yeah, 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 that was November. it, yeah. Back again. Yeah. Yeah. And we were still wearing masks on trains, but not in Saxony. Yes, the different states so have different rules. As we went rules. on the train to Berlin, the moment we hit Brandenburg, the official game of the train does put our marks on. And like, well, even the Germans have never been. Also, this is ridiculous, you know. We've been sat here for the last two hours. And now, for the last 25 minutes, you have to put a mask on. Well, it's like that when you got like a train up to Scotland, you cross the border and they make the announcement. And SB2 in Germany. Yes, that's the yeah, had the right sort. I was there in November last year because my girlfriend's at Heidelberg University. Oh, right. So, um, and she, she kept saying to me, make sure you wear a mask. But I went out sort of to ride the trams on my own. I'll just buy a coffee and um, make it last the whole journey. Now, do you speak German? Only, I understand bits of it, but not properly, no. The only German I really know was from our own pair girls, one of them came from Heidelberg. Oh, okay. This is back in the... Yeah. Back in the early mid 60s. <laughs> I have to be careful though, I say things that it's got a lifetime ago. My mother the other day said, You know, dear, I never thought I'd have two retired sons. You know, and I said, well, mother, we never thought we'd have an aging mother in her 90s, you know. And then it changed. My grandparents all died at ages considerably younger than I am now. Yeah. Are we guessing that? Can we see the sun in there? No. Are we there yet? Are we there yet? I know if um, yeah, fine. If Mr. Perks was here, it'd be recorded the sound, and it'd be playing this as um, the latest Mozart symphony at his house. It is a great sound. Well, certainly I'm recording the sound, but we're pretty sure. Well. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
wave last year I, had to, I was taking a tour to the Channel Islands and um, yeah it was, it was interesting seeing how it affected people that people were really forgetting things. And, oh, um, yeah. Well I, I'm used to the heat in that I, I used to be tour specialist for India oh, wow. and Japan places in Africa I mean I've I don't worry about high heat, it's just that Britain doesn't sort of deal with it, so we're not... We can't deal with heat and we can't deal with cold. Yeah. Well, the day the tour finished, there was all this announcement saying don't travel, you know, because of the heat. And I said to everyone, well look, you know, you just get on with your journeys. And uh, they said, well, what are you doing? Are you going home? I said, no, I'm going to the Isle of Wight for the morning because it's, it's about 20 or 10 degrees cooler there than it was on the mainland. So I had a very pleasant morning. And that, that was the hottest weather I've ever had steam on. I was amazed they were running steam on the Isle of Wight Railway. Well, yes, because last summer was a problem with steam, of course, for setting the line down. Yeah, but I was thinking I might get one of their diesels, which are quite rare to travel behind, unless they have a gala. But no, they actually were running. So I had steam, I think, in 33 degrees. It's the hottest I've ever had steam in, in the UK. Have you ever done their Bosnia, uh, you know, the Yugoslavia tour? Yes. My dad and I did that a few years ago. That was brilliant. So you with, with RTC? Yeah. So you were the, who were your tour manager? It was Nigel and Yana. Oh, Nigel and Yana? Yeah. And Yanis, you know Yanis. I know Yanis. Yeah. Yes, I know Yanis at all. Yeah. And uh, Yana, Yana and I took the last tour out to Ukraine. She was. Like, of course she's Ukrainian, isn't she? Yeah. And um, I, I didn't share it with the book. I didn't get arrested there, but I did get thrown out of the hotel because I refused to pay the bribe that they wanted. And basically, they were saying the bill had to be paid, which it had to be. And um, there was a long thing going on. And, yeah, they said, I'll throw everybody out of the hotel. So I just thought, this up, and I said, you're really going to throw 50 people out of the hotel? Please do. You know, can you imagine the story? So he read you and said, I'll throw you out. So I said, that's all right, I should go. And Yarn was outside and the snow's beginning to fall. You yeah, what do we do? The, the tours and tunnels. I said, no, it isn't. They don't know anything that's happened. I said, we'll see them at breakfast. He said, well, what about you? I said, I'll find a hotel and I'll meet you in the morning at the station. And most of them didn't even know I'd been in them. <laughs> got up to a little Soviet hotel. Yeah. Met a Russian couple who put me up in this funny old hotel. Terrible that the brides in Ukraine and Yana were so embarrassed. She was a good laugh to have on the tour. Lovely, but... lovely girl, very lovely girl. And, um, I speak Russian, you see, so. I do, I like it. So, you know, it helps. So, is she still doing stuff for RPC or was that? No, 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 that's more or less stuff than I do. Yeah. But um, I, I have heard from her a couple of times. Yeah. I, I still would like to, I, still, I need to go back to Russia, but I'd love to go back to the Ukraine as well. Yeah, I kept in touch with her for a while, yeah. but. It's difficult because. Put it this way, might if she saw me messaging her. And she's married now, isn't yeah, she? Yes, she is. To, uh, to a Lithuanian. Lithuanian, yeah. Well, I, I know Lithuania as well, you see. Yeah. I, I used to be in the Soviet Union back in the oh, right. 79, 81, 82, 83. I was based in Moscow. Oh, okay. So I got to know a lot of the, the Baltic states. Yeah. Now, I've always been quite fascinated by that area. I can't show you a picture now because obviously my phone's busy, but um, my, my everyday cars are larder. Ah, oh, brilliant! And there's like hardly any left. There's, there's lit I mean, I think Lava Reavers, there's less than 20 on the road, but 
I insist on keeping mine going, much to my mother's and girlfriend's annoyance. It's only a PS124. Exactly, yeah. They, they, there's one in America that they put a PA to. Oh, okay. They drag race. And have you seen the photographs of the stretch larders in Cuba? Yes. That are quite grotesque. Look, it's a deer. There's a deer walking up in front of us. The deer baby is on the right hand side. If you could pass it on. The deer. So there she goes. It's gone up behind the fence. I can't see. Thank you. Well, that's one less option for stuff for the season. Yeah. It might be at the end of the forest. Comments are both balls, not a stone one. I suppose you can walk with a stone one. I haven't got my knife now, so how are we going to do that? Might be another passing then, because the track eases out and there's signal. Or are we at the summit? Is this the summit? I would say this is the summit. Yeah. That's good because my arm hurts from having this position. Yeah, see, they go blue when. Is this the summit? I don't think this is the summit. I think it's just a... Who's got the map? I've got the map. One of my fondest memories would be when we go back onto the Akinsay barn on Tuesday. Oh, yeah. I was there once on the national day here in Austria and we were in Montage and the rest of the train were completely in their truck. Everybody wears truck on the national day. And as we left the station, one of the one of the groups started to yodel. <laughs> And all across the valleys as we went up, everybody was singing to one another. It was the most amazing thing. Quite magical. But it's a little known fact that the champion yodeler of Austria for the last eight or nine years is the Japanese. <laughs> he's, he's a superstar here in Austria, but it's just sort of a matter of some some concern that Austria has not produced a world-class yodeler for some while now. <laughs> 
there. Yeah. yeah. That's another reason why they don't like the loco and carriage couples, because it's loco derailed. I can, we're actually higher than the parachuters. I can, I can see people out there parachuting and we're, we're higher than them. Ah, yes, there is the top. This is where you'll tell us the restaurant is on the next summit along. Have a short walk. The restaurant is 200 metres up from the station. Yeah, I can see over to Salzburg. I don't see any of you having a problem yet. I've, I've talked to one or two who I wondered if it would be an issue. And they said they're fine, so I think I should all be fine. Yes, but the worst thing you can do is to worry people. <laughs> yeah. I haven't really done it, so I, I don't personally know what it's like, so it's very difficult to, yeah. to get there. I can only go on what I do is stop. Ian, Ian, it might be the 200 metres back down after the main street. Anybody who has bad knees or ankles will tell you that it's coming down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Amplified yeah. now. I'd like to come up here in winter, mate. I think we're seeing it on one of the very best days. Yeah. Gloriously. Look, we're going to be higher than the moon in a minute. There's an aeroplane down there. It's when you look down, you suddenly see there's a helicopter hovering below. Well, I just saw an aeroplane. Yeah, yeah. Going down the valley. I like how that the um, the smoke is overtaking its train. See now, look, the smoke's yeah. overtaking the train. I can see the footpath that runs all along through the street.
That's a footpath down there. into the robot. Well, that has to 
that's a bit part of the outside range leading to this. Once we the whole range, there'll probably be a few fights on top. Yes, Let, let's do that. I'll just get it. I think I will be wild. Yes, so she's the young about to get some more amplified thrash in a minute. Going up to another one. Pizza Yeah, Oh wow, a tunnel. I wasn't expecting this one. The amplification's going to get a bit mad now. Well, it's only not steamed up here because my um, I can hear cowbells. Can I hear cowbells? I think it's the rattle of the axle, isn't it? Oh, oh there's the there's another railway. Look, there's a funicular. There's actually a funicular from here to the very top. For but it doesn't the, look like it's working. It's probably used for um, <coughs> delivering post. Possibly. There you are. 800 kilograms. Yeah. So as if there, this isn't high enough, there has to be another record. Okay chaps, your task, should you choose to accept it, is to reconnoiter and try and take the rest of it. <laughs> That's where we're diving. What time are we up there? Now. <laughs> we'll walk, up, we'll up, walk up slowly when we've taken the photograph. I'll check the diving what time he wants us for the future. We're a bit later, aren't we, than the programme? We're just past six now. And what time will we use you here at six, maybe? That's a good question. Have you got your thing handy? I'd like to go and walk at the end. Yeah.
Oh no, it doesn't. Just enjoy dinner. Yeah. So I, I, I think we have to come. I'll, I'll, yeah. I'll find that. So much. I'll find so that. Wait, this is. That's the people who come up the lazy way, they walk. <laughs> <laughs> 